What's up guys and gals? Welcome on into the Nerd Castle for a little bit more of Der Indie Games Battle Royale Tycoon. Now, you guys remember back in the day we played Hyper Knights. We've also played a little bit of Ninja Tycoons. Well, Endless Loop Studios has a new game out and it's called Battle Royale Tycoon where the goal is to create like Battle Royale arenas with weapons and stuff like that that people can play inside of. Now, I personally think that Battle Royale is a scourge on gaming. That's just Splatty's opinion. I think there's better stuff out there that you can dedicate your time to, but if you enjoy them, that's cool. And this sort of pokes fun at the tropes. So let's go ahead and check the game on out. The park is called Shooty Land. Uh, no, the the the, the proper name, the God-given name here, is Blickyland. That's you gotta come to Blickyland if you want to get yourself all settled in and grab yourself a Glock, keep that thing cocked until you let it pop, and then you let it drop. Welcome to your park. Here we're gonna entertain your guests and fulfill their needs while making a profit. Let us begin by placing a simple building. Select target practice. Okay. Target practice it is. But I don't like that spot. That spot is not lined up with what I wanted. That that spot is that spot is poo. I don't like it. This is the building window. You can drag it by holding okay. Try it now. Oh, look, I can do the thing the tutorial I can do the thing the tutorial told me to do. I can do it. Uh, click to continue. Here you can do the building requirements. Let's place an entrance. Okay. Entrance is right there. Next, we can place the exit. Rotate with R or middle mouse click. Oh. I see what you got going on. Target practice needs a target lane, which is where the guest is going to go. I see. Need item slots for weapons. Okay, we'll put that right there. Sounds good. Target practice is ready to go. Now we need a worker to serve the guest. Open up the workers window. Okay, I will hire a worker. Hire six? Oh my god, my overhead. My overhead sense is tingling. Alright, workers hire will begin working as transporters moving items in between the buildings. Okay, you can now move the camera. Okay, yep, we can do that. Alright, now that we have workers, let's assign one to target practice over here. Okay, I can do that. A worker has been assigned. Let's see if he comes on over here with his little jerkin or whatever it is. Oh, he puts the bottles in place. Gotcha. Bottles and cans and just clap your hands. And just clap your hands. Let's buy some weapons for the guests to use. Uh, yeah, a pistol sounds good. Let's go with five pistols. Our transporters will now take the weapons to the target practice and put them in the item slots. Okay, we'll go ahead and do that. I believe in your ability to do... Oh, yeah, look at that. He put the little pistol right there. Okay, does anybody want to play around with Blicky Land? Now we need a place to put the others. Select a warehouse. Okay. Warehouse right there. All right, a little warehouse action on that side. Looks good to me. Let's add a waiting queue to our target practice entrance. Select the waiting queue. All right. Oh, I see what they wanted me to do right there. Okay, so you gotta connect things via... You gotta connect things via... So I can open this now. Okay, it's open for business. Come get your shooting on, everybody. Come get your shooting on. Our guests also have needs. We can solve them. Otherwise, they will leave the park unhappy. Put a food kiosk over here to solve their hunger. Okay, enjoy your food kiosk right there. Uh, what are we putting to the side of it? A drink kiosk? Okay. Looks good to me. And then a bathroom for the bladder. Looks good. Can I put in more toilets? I was going to say, I kind of feel like we need to... I kind of feel like more toilets is a good play. There we go. Three toilets. That looks good to me. I'm going to open that bat. Oh, I need an exit. Okay. So, like, where's my exit at? Let's do the exit like... Oh, I don't know. Maybe I'll put the exit right there. Yeah, that looks good. Then I need like an entrance. Entrance can be like right there. Looks good. Bathroom ready to go? All right, bathroom's ready to go. Looking good. We need workers over here. All right, add a worker. Food kiosk? Add a worker. There we go. So we have added workers. Drink kiosk can be open. That can be open. Oh, we're doing it. We're doing it, everybody. We're doing it. They said that I couldn't open a gun-related fun theme park. They was wrong. Yeah, just like connect all of that right there. Connect every last bit of it. Oh my god, there's shooting guns on that side. Weapons lose durability with each use. Let's build a workshop to repair them. Okay. 
$2,000 for a workshop? Are you out of your damn mind? Like, I guess the workshop can go over here, like in this little area. That looks good. Uh, we need an entrance and an exit. So the exit can be like, right, ma. All right, so I've got an exit now. Uh, maybe a couple item slots. Looks good. Maybe like a workbench or two. Yeah, something like that right there and something like that right there. I think I might have needed to rotate them, but maybe they'll be able to fit in right there. I got to hire two workers. All right, add some workers to it. Transporters will now bring damaged items to be repaired. Looks good to me. Oh, look at that. They walk around the desk. Nice. That's what I was kind of like concerned about. You guys go ahead and run some maintenance on my ish real fast. We need more transporters. Open the workers window. Then we can set the minimum number of transporters. Workers will be hired automatically when we assign one to a building. All right. So we'll set that to five. That's where I figured they were going with that. Perfect. We got transporters now. Looks good to me. Let's build our first arena. Currently, the only type we can build is a dual arena. So select it and build it. All right. So we got an arena duel over here. If you guys want to kill each other, I give you my permission and my blessing. Oh my god, we built an arena. Alright, so we got our arena over here. Let me move that window real fast. We need an entrance. I'm actually going to, like, demolish. Well, I don't want a place. I don't like where it is right now. I was just fiddling with stuff. I was just playing, dog. I was just playing. Alright, so there's the entrance. And there's the exit. So we've got a wait queue that's going to have to be over here too. So spawn positions. Uh, we will put a spawn there and a spawn there. And then they can duke it out. Place some walls. All right. So we'll put like some walls right there. That's the entrance. All right. So we'll have the entrance right there. That looks good. And then we'll have like a little bit of cover right there. Little little T wall on this side. A little bit of this and that here and there. All right, and then we'll put some low cover. Kind of like in various areas. There we go. That looks good. I think we can I think we can do that. As you can see, the arena balance is now good. Uh, here you can view the weapon type used by the building. We can click to change it. Now, we want it to be rifles. Dude, do people just, like, come in here to shoot each other? Dude, this is like the American dream right here. Uh, guests have preferences that will get a happiness bonus if the building uses their favorite weapon. All right, so I assume we got to buy some rifles, right? All right, we'll get, like, five of those. Got, like, crates and things we can put around. All right, looks good. Have some crates over there. There's, like, some poles. Uh, maybe we'll put, like, a bottle over here. Like, kind of just, like, litter it with stuff. There we go. Perfect. Looks all right to me. We can do, a, like, a health pack. Oh, cool. Put, like, health packs in. Yeah, that sounds good. Health packs sound like the plan. All right. As far as the arena duel goes, how many workers do I need? I don't think I need that many workers. I think like two will probably do just fine. Yeah, let's have two workers out here. And then we need like what? Weapon placements? Yeah, we need item slots. So we'll put like an item slot like over here. Like an item slot over there. That looks good. I think it'll be alright. We've got flags running around too. Oh good, they put the rifles in. Nice. Okay. Are we ready to go right here? I think I should probably put in like a weight queue though too, huh? Where do I do the weight queue at? Oh, we got flashbangs as well. All right. Are the workers just going to hang out in there while it's like a free fire zone? Oh, that seems like a mistake, man. I'll be putting my head down real fast. I can't be getting shot like this. Like, I'm not feeling it. Open the arena and entertain four guests. Make sure you buy rifles and have a waiting queue. Control time with one, two, and three. Okay. Where's my weight queue at? Got entrances and exits. Maybe it was in a different spot. Where's the wait queue at? There it is. Maybe I'll just turn that into grass right there? I don't know, man. I don't know. They're not being specific about what I need to do right now. Maybe something like that. It 
That seems all right. So they're going to line up and do their thing. Yeah, I placed this in kind of a disadvantageous location. Damn, they just wasted each other. That's a dead man right there. Oh, never mind. He's all right. He's all right. It's just some minor bullet wounds. He's good. He's good. We got people waiting in line right now for the next arena duel. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. I think I probably should have, like, moved this around slightly. Must remove the waiting queue before you remove the entrance. Oh, okay. So we'll put that right there. At least they gave me a tooltip so that I knew what I was doing. All right. So what I need to do is we're going to take, like, this entire area right here. We're going to kind of cut that inwards. Like, that looks okay to me. But I sort of set this up to have a different entrance. But I guess it'll have to do for right now. I'm going to put that right there. And then we've got our waiting queue. Yeah, we'll kind of extend that out. There we go. Now we're good to go. I'll probably put in some... Oh, we got... In order to place more advanced buildings, we need to research them in the lab. Okay. How big does the lab have to be? Like that big right there? Alright, looks good to me. And we can do research right now if we really, really want to. Let me get a desk over here, though. I'm feeling the desks. We gotta, we gotta put in a couple of these dudes on this side so we can get that done. We built seven buildings. Aw, yeah. So we can get an arena dual medium. We can get capture the flag. We can get arena team deathmatch. Or we can get arena battle royale medium over here. See, various buildings you can research. Let's start off with capture the flag small. All right. So we now apparently know how to manage our little location. Dude, that guy's pushing him kind of hard right now. Then again, he was going for that health pack. Apparently, they want me to make the most successful park of all time. That seems a little bit of a high expectation for someone such as me. But I'm going to do my best. There we go. There's our exit right there. That needs to be connected with ground as far as I understand it. Yes, that looks good right there. That'll work. And then we should hire a couple of workers to do our research for us. Perfect. So we got two more guys up inside of here making this happen. Blicky Land is developing according to specification. Let it be known. Let it be known, Nerd Castle. It's developing according to specification. All right, so there's our little internal walkway right there. We've got more room for other stuff. Our dueling arena is hopefully bringing in money. I don't know what people are paying in order to, like, get in there and do that thing, but hopefully they're doing something. So Capture the Flag Small is on its way through. I think I'll probably set up a couple more firing ranges over here. I think that sounds like an okay idea. Uh, let's go to the park, and we will do a... I don't really want, like, an arena battle royale. We'll probably do, like, a shooting range. Yeah, let's do some. let's do some target practice over here. Target practice seems like a reasonable way to expand our empire. So we'll do that right there. And then with the target practice, we'll have the entrance like right there. No, we won't have the entrance right there. We'll have the exit right there. That'll be Das Exit. Or it won't. Maybe I have to do the entrance first. Maybe that's what it is. All right. So there's the entrance. It's so weird. Like, the placement of the stuff. Like, I don't know where it wants things to be. There we go. That's where I wanted it to be right there initially. We'll take this over here. All right. So we've got a path that connects that. Uh, we need a waiting queue. All right. And this will be shotgun target practice. We will put an item slot right there. Item slot right there. And the weapon type will be shotguns. Yeah, don't keep the pistols in there. We want those to be shotguns. And then we need a targeting lane right here. So the shooter stands right there. Looks good to me. Apparently they slap in another wall if it doesn't fit like perfectly. Uh, we need a worker over here. I need to buy some shotguns. We get like five of those. That sounds all right. This place is for shotgun target practice. 
Go ahead and, yeah, move the guns around. We got 10 park rating. Nice, dude. Uh, yeah, I think I'll put an assault rifle target practice up here as well. We'll keep it nice and organized for right now. All right, so target practice is open. Well, don't give him a... Uh, is that a pistol slot? Is that why? The item slot must be empty. All right, close this down. And how do I get the item slot to be empty? I mean, I can add a shotgun slot. That's no biggie. Like, I guess we can keep the pistols in there. I don't really want the pistols in there, but I guess it'll have to do for right now. There we go. We'll open it back up. We're not really, like, earning money right now. This is the part that concerns me. Maybe somebody will select the shotguns, though. I don't know. My goal here is to bulldoze that. But I think I'm going to have to wait until they do something else. And so the wait queue is looking good right there. Let's go ahead and we'll add another shooting range over here. Although it might be better to just have, like, one big unified shooting range. Like, the upkeep on all this might be a tad too much. Like, a touch too much. Oh, that's for the wrong thing. I got the wrong thing lined up right there. I wanted target practice. There we go. And then with this one, we will have the entrance on the bottom side, as we've been doing before. We'll have the exit on that side right there. Looks good. We'll hire a worker. Uh, the item slot will be for assault rifles over here. And we will take an item slot. We will have a plethora of assault rifles. Drop that in right there. And then hopefully this can be opened very shortly. I need a wait queue though. There we go. Wait queue accomplished. If you want to shoot some assault rifles, this is the place that you can shoot some assault rifles. So we got like our little training area over here. People can use pistols. People can use shotguns. People can use rifles. Doesn't really matter. I feel like I could have been more efficient and just had one shooting range for each. But you know what? Maybe it'll help keep things organized or something. I don't know. They're fixing guns over here. That looks good. Maybe I should add another... Yeah, add another workbench real fast and then hire another worker right there. We are bleeding out on money right now, which is a little bit unfortunate. Like, I wish that we were not. I think we need assault rifles. Yeah, let's buy a few more over here. I want to make this more entertaining, too. So it might be a decent idea... To put like a pistol slot over there. Put like a pistol slot right there. And then maybe like a shotgun slot. Like somewhere around the middle. So that they can use their favorite weapon. That dude just did some side flips. These people are doing it right now. They're doing it big man. This is what I call an American vacation right here. Apparently Mutton Chops wins. Y'all need to finish each other off quicker. Mutton Chops is apparently the champion of the arena right now. This man is taking care of business out here. All right. Well, let's see if we're net positive or net negative on our money for the moment. So I'm just going to, like, let it ride. I guess everybody wants to use the shotguns over here. Well, that's pretty wild. We got a lot of people that are, like, stoked about shotgun practice right now. I'm kind of thinking I'm just going to make one big shooting range. Seems like it might be a decent plan. Do I have like a... Yeah, I was going to say, I need like a... Like a cash rating right now to figure out where we're at. I think we're making a little bit of money, but I'd like to renovate this area. Yeah, close these down. I want to do I want to do better over here. I, I think I can do better. All right, so close that ish down. 
bulldoze the whole thing. And then we're going to make one big unified shooting range for target practice. Oh, maybe I can't. That would be an interesting problem. So I may have just bulldozed. I should have saved first. I may have just bulldozed. See, I wanted to have a I wanted to have a shooting range that did everything, and now I'm learning the hard way that maybe I can't do that. Uh, I need an entrance. We'll slap it in right there to target practice. Uh, the weight cue will be right here. I don't think they like the exits, guys. I don't think they like my exits. I don't think they're feeling it. There we go. So the exit's right there. How many of these can I put in here? I can put in two. Maybe three, actually. Oh, but that closes off the other ranges. No! How do I get rid of these internal walls? I guess I could do it like that right there. There we go. That looks good. Let's hire two workers for the target practice. And then what I need is I'm trying to make this work a little bit more effectively. Oh my god, I'm bleeding out cash right now. I'm bleeding, everybody. I'm bleeding. It hurts. All right, so we got pistol slots. We'll go like... Two pistol slots. We'll go two shotgun slots. We'll go two AR slots. Although I don't know where I'm going to put the AR slots at. Hopefully they can walk over the top of those. This right here is now opened. There we go. You can let people like get in line and do their thing. Maybe I'll hire a third worker over here just to make it go a little faster with the gun moving. Yeah, I'm trying to get like flow throughout here. Like how fast can I get people in and out of this location? We did give them the opportunity to use their favorite weapons though, which I think is really, really good. Did we finish off the arena research? We did. Okay, so do... We can do a great pistol over there. What does that do? The park size expands? Okay. Uh, do arena... No, not arena dual medium. Do arena team deathmatch. Well, never mind then. I guess it's not going to work for us. I'm definitely going to need to see some repaired weapons coming through though. I am not making money at the rate that I had hoped I would be making money at. We seem to be kind of hurting for cash right now. Is there a way that I can raise the entrance fee or whatever? I don't even think anybody's using the food and drink kiosk. Hold up. We may need weight cues over here. Seems possible. I do. Oof. There we go. I was missing out on a source of income. Big time missing out on a source of income. There we go. Our park rating will get a little bit better. Hopefully we'll make some money off concession sales. That does look like it's giving us a slow trickle. We might be on our way back up right now. It's ugly. It's ugly and I don't much like what's happening over here. I kind of want to rebuild this in a separate location. Just to like let it happen a little bit more effectively. 250 guests entertained. Yeah, now we're making money. There we go. Now we're on a slight uptick, I think. We'll wait and see, like, this month what happens. God, that is a razor-thin profit margin, though. It's definitely not perfect, but I think missing out on concessions was the big issue that we had going on right there. I didn't see the part where you needed a wait line. 
All right, well, at least now we can stall and, like, wait it out when we want to get stuff done. I'll probably close these down and I'll build them in a different area, in all fairness. I'll probably rotate them this way with a path that leads to the middle to get to our workstations and everything, which will all be over here. And then once that's done, we'll have kind of flow through. Like, this will be all the attractions and everything over here. This will be our work area over on this side. But I kind of like what they're going for. It's a simple game, but, like, I'm finding it to be, like, entertaining. Like, I want to figure out all the little quirks and make it work. But anyways, this game is called Battle Royale Tycoon. If you guys wanted to check it out, I got a link for you down below. Thank you for joining me for another dive into the world of indie games. My passion, the thing that I am super, super into. Uh, my name is Splattercat. I look through the pile to find what's worthwhile in indie games. If you're ever looking for something new, this is the place to be. So hit that sub button, like the video if you enjoyed it. And I will see you all next time. Hi to everybody.